it doesn't get any much bigger uh, in the last couple of years of Rosedale on the east side. Rosedale coach Joaquin Williams was a part of the battle for Bolivar County as a player and now a coach. After a rocky first game, his Eagles are beginning to spread their wings just in time for their game with Eastside. We actually have to gain experience as we're going along. And again, we're taking it one practice at a time, one week at a time, and just trying to get better each week that we come out. While the Eagles begin to take flight, Eastside is coming off of a loss to 5A Oxford. But players and coaches plan to put the lessons from that loss to good use against Rosedale. The guys cannot have that mindset of we're better than everybody, or we're the best, and we cannot be satisfied with where we are now. We've got to continue to push ourselves to get better. And instead of seeing balls fly high in the air like this, you'll be seeing a lot of balls high and tight being held like this because both Rosedale and Eastside plan on dominating on the ground. Especially Eastside with their three-headed attack of Quadre Butler, Tequil Eatman, and Baron Burns. I love them, I love them, like brothers. They push me, I push them, you know, it's great. And if Rosedale can halt the Trojans running game and pull out the win, it could be a big boost for Coach Williams and his Eagles. It's uh, one more step on our goal. Uh, this year we started out fairly young, fairly inexperienced, and our goal was to just get better every week. And uh, east side is another week that uh, we have to get better. Lane Fobbs, ABC6 Sports.